dear friends, colleagues, ladies and gentlemen, we are really living extraordinary times. Times of existential threats and times of consequences. But also times where science has never been clearer, awareness has never been greater of the impacts that we are having on the consequences this is having, not just on the natural world, but also on our future prosperity, on our future equality, uh, on our social cohesion, health, well-being, and why not, happiness. Uh, this is a new understanding of the role of nature in our own lives. This is a rediscovery, a new awakening, a reckoning of, of the importance of nature. And that has led governments just uh, two years ago to agree to a, for the first time, to a global goal of nature of halt and reverse biodiversity loss by 2030. Extremely ambitious and a measurable global goal for nature, a nature positive goal, net positive biodiversity by 2030. This is historic and requires transformational change. And that's why the Nature Positive Initiative, as Dolores said, the coalition of a global organization leading in the space of sustainability from different sectors in society, has, has, has come together to do two things. First of all, to protect, to preserve the integrity of the Nature Positive goal. Because Nature Positive is not a slogan. Nature Positive is a measurable goal we all have to measure ourselves against it. And at the same time also, we are together coming to align on providing guidance to deliver genuine nature positive outcomes. This is uh, uh, the purpose of the initiative and as part of this uh, mandate, uh, purpose and objectives, we have started a consultation to try to uh, build consensus on how to measure nature positive. 